Hello, I am Dr. Atma Ranjan Das. I am a senior consultant neurosurgeon at Care Hospital Bhubaneswar, Odisha. Uh, today we will discuss about endoscopic spine surgery and laser spine surgery. This is something very uh, new and recent. When you talk about endoscopy of spine, there are, we have to understand it is not a single endoscopic technique. There are four generation of spine endoscopy. The first generation of spine endoscopy is known as Destendu technique, which is the oldest technique of spine endoscopy, but it is almost like an open endoscopic technique where the same uh, in, uh, muscle damage and bleeding happens like an open surgery or microscopic surgery. So, but this was the first uh, um, generation of endoscopy which started in France. Then we move to the Second generation of endoscopy. Second generation uh, uh, generation of endoscopy is known as transforaminal endoscopy. Transforaminal endoscopy, where we go through the foramen of the uh, nerve root and there we decompress the disc, which is known as second generation of endoscopy, which started in uh, uh, Germany and Korea. Then we have a third generation of endoscopy. Third generation of endoscopy is known as PSLD or interlaminar endoscopy, which is also a modification of a previous generation of endoscopy where we use water medium and radio frequency wave for the surgery and we recently we have the fourth generation of endoscopy which is known as bipotal endoscopy. It is same as the laparoscopy of the abdomen where you have two ports and in the laparoscopy uh, surgery we take air uh, as a medium but here we take water as a medium or saline as a medium where the perception of color perception of your neural structure or nerves and muscles is so brilliant and it is so magnified that it has, it has become the best endoscopic surgery in this uh, era. So how we have to understand how it is done, we make two holes and with a laser probe we do not cut your muscle or uh, bone, we just go with a very small endoscope where we take out uh, the problem of the disc or canal stenosis with that sm very small endoscope where destined or first generation of endoscopy incision was almost around 2 cm but here the incision is almost 5 mm which is almost around 1 fourth to 1 fifth of the size of the previous generation of endoscopy. So this is the most advanced endoscopy of the spine, it ha you can do fusions with this endoscopy. Suppose you have a fracture in the spine and your doctor advises you for a fusion because you have a fracture so you have to fuse it with screws and uh, artificial disc. That also can be done with a bipotal endoscopy which was not possible in previous generation of endoscopy. So if you are to go in, if you come within the 10% of the population which eventually does not get relieved by medicine, physiotherapy and other uh, methods, conservative methods of uh, clearing your back, back pain problem. Then if you are choosing for the operation, see operation is always a choice in the back. There is no emergency in surgery in back uh, pain or PIVD. But if you are missing your duties and not able to walk, you are not enjoying life, your lifestyle is getting changed because of severe back pain, then you can opt for a surgical option. If you are opting for a surgical option, then you should know what bipodal endoscopy is and older generation of endoscopy is. So if you can, if you are choosing a uh, thing, always choose the most advanced way of endoscopy and get yourself cured. Thank you. So